This is Kirsten from the Dallas Austin area. Her family believes she's being held by traffickers. She was last seen October 4th. She has attempted to reach out to family and then immediately afterwards her social media accounts will be deactivated. Hunt County is the department to call with any information. Her case number is here on the screen. Caitlin Dooley is also missing from Missouri. She went missing on 11-14-2022. If you have any information at all, call Polk County Sheriff's Office. Sari and Lisandro, they were reported as runaways, but they're not. Their family said that they had permission to be dating. She was talking to someone online who was going to help her edit videos and post them online and they've not been heard from since this is the car they were in that is the license plate nobody has heard from them at all emily dubes i've included a video from her family here she's only 15 years old and they believe she's being held against her will please continue to share and pray for our sweet girl emily dubes we wanted to get a message out there just in case she is somewhere where she is able to leave wherever she's at and come home. We love you and you are not in trouble and all we want is for you to come home. You are not in any trouble. Please just come home. And like by any chance you do see this, please come home. We miss you. Polly needs snuggles. We still gotta have a brother and sister day, Lou. We need to come home. We can't do it without you. We understand that she is being labeled as a repeat runaway. Let me clarify. She has left the house without permission two times before this. And both times she was back in less than six hours. This time she left and she took nothing. Not her phone, not a jacket, nothing. And we're at the end of day five. Regardless, she is a 15 year old child and she needs to be brought home safe. And we as a family are asking the public to refrain from posting any lies or any nasty comments. This is hard enough without having to deal with that. All we want is for her to come home safe. If anyone out there has any information at all in regards to where she is, we ask that you please call 573 Four four two six one three one, and if you see her in person, we ask that you immediately call nine one one and report it. We just want you to come home. This is Nakayla Williams. She was last seen in Indianapolis on November eighth, twenty twenty one, the day she left her mother's home in the forty eight hundred block of North Kenmore Road. She got into a gray or white pickup with a loud engine. That evening, she left her residence. She was never seen again. Her cell phone last pinged along Kentucky Avenue shortly after her disappearance. This man here could be named Destin or Beston Hoyle. He was the last person allegedly to see her and authorities state that they were seeking him for questioning. They didn't say he was a suspect, but they believe that this person may know exactly where Michaela is. Authorities believe they may have gone to Flint, Michigan, but they're just not sure. Police are stating foul place not suspected, but her situation is unusual. This is my fourth time uploading a video about the grown men and you know where my 15 year old little cousin is so I am not going to include any opinions about this, I am only going to speak the facts. This is Clifton James Thomas Tyler of Northeast Maryland. He is 20 years old. This is some of the fun things that Clifton James Thomas Tyler of Northeast Maryland does in his free time. 
Clifton James Thomas Tyler is one of the last people that Alexis was seen with. He knows where she is. Clifton James Thomas Tyler is 20 years old. Alexis is 15. This is Isaiah Buckle, also of Northeast Maryland. He is also 20. Alexis is still 15. Isaiah Buckle's record is locked by the state. Alexis has been missing for almost a month. They are the last two people who have seen her. They have lawyered up. They are refusing to speak to the police. They are refusing to speak to the private investigator or the family. Please stop taking this video down. There is a 15 year old little girl who is in danger. All anybody wants is Alexis home safe. All of these missing posters and others are listed in a Google Drive that will be posted to the community wall here. And if you are following the Facebook page, Chasing Truth, Chasing the Lost, that folder is also posted there. It's very simple. You just click into the link, click any of the posters, and you can download them to your phone or your computer and share them on your own social media.